the American dream is fading. Only half of kids today will go on to earn more than their parents did. Why has this happened? And how can we reverse the fading of the American dream? When thinking about how to answer these questions, you might not think of big data as a place to look. Big data is often associated with corporations seeking to improve the products they offer by collecting troves of data on their customers. But what if we could use big data for social good to address problems such as the fading American dream, growing income inequality, or persistent racial disparities? This course will teach you how to use big data, coupled with the tools of data science and economics, to solve some of the most important social problems of our time. Where are you getting your students from? Because my research was the first to uncover that colleges were hedging their bets. They were getting their new diversity from old sources. We wanted to make sure uh, that we had cradle to career, that we thought about children from birth, because we wanted to follow the science, and the science seemed clear about that. So the tools that you're going to learn in this class will be applicable not just to the types of problems that we'll discuss here in the United States, but globally around the world. An advantage of kind of big data that kind of maintains a data set of everybody uh, in the in the population is you're able to follow people over time in a much more easily, uh, in a much easier fashion. Big data helps us cut through politically charged debates and find out what policies actually work from a scientific perspective, making the often discussed notion of evidence-based policymaking a reality. Big social problems require big data solutions.